the orders of manufacture, the material will reach the worksite palletized and identified for on-site storage. On-site marking begins by using a laser mechanism or similar system to first mark the vertical lines for the placement of the brackets and to check the alignment of the holes and the corners. The brackets should always be attached to sturdy elements and retaining brackets are combined with support brackets to allow for the expansion of the aluminum edging that will be attached to the brackets. The brackets are placed at the distances indicated in the facade project plan. After the brackets have been installed, the vertical profiles are added and their verticality and alignment are checked. The expansion joints of the building must be respected. The profiles must be installed from the top down and their length must not exceed 6 meters. The profiles are attached to the support brackets by drilling through the side sections of the profiles and inserting a through bolt for each bracket. The vertical distance between brackets is usually 1.5 meters to facilitate spacing floor by floor, but this will depend on the attachment system used and the 10 and 12 millimeters should be allowed for expansion. Where they cross the vertical profiles, the horizontal ones are attached to them with two self-drilling screws. A continuous chamber at least 3 cm wide, ventilated by natural convection behind the cladding, must be ensured to prevent condensation and provide optimal thermal performance. Suction cups are used to allow the correct positioning of each slab. Horizontal joints can vary between 4 and 8 millimeters, and vertical joints can be set at between 4 and 10 millimeters. To prevent any movement of the horizontal slabs by a possible settling of the building, key joints are placed to prevent maintenance. Its durability allows large slabs to be used without needing to increase the substructure for their installation. The large format slabs can be adapted to any design without limitations and can be integrated with other materials such as LT as well.